season opener of the Pro Bat All-Star Series. Lisa, we're talking blown alcohol, dirt drags at their best. That's right. The top, so many, I'm not going to give a number because we don't know yet, Brian, but the top in the United States, the top drag cars, that is, guys. I mean, I'm talking nothing but action-packed, adrenaline from Pro Bat. Absolutely right. Of course, we've got a great uh, a great weather uh, situation here on tap for the race. Couldn't ask for a better uh, track setup. Got a chance to check out the track uh, just a little bit earlier. Looks like it's going to hook up great. These cars are going to gonna fly. They're going to fly, and we have got some awesome interviews coming your way. Stay tuned. You're not going to want to miss these guys and what they have to say, because let me tell you, they're going to have a lot to say. I just know it. <laughs> there you great go. season has started, and the cars are fresh and ready, and you talking about... I can't wait to see what we're going to see. Absolutely right, friends. And it's Mud Truck TV coming to you live from Cobbtown. Mud Truck Television is proud to present professional racing organization's Blown Alcohol Dirt Dragsters All-Star Series Nationals. Brought to you by AFCO Racing Shocks. ProBell Safety Bell Housings. If it doesn't say ProBell, it's just a can. SCS Gearbox, when reliability matters. And Power Pro Racing, pros that know use Power Pro. Hang on, race fans. On the way, the start of today's race, the Pro Bad All Star Series Nationals in Cobbtown, Georgia, on Mud Truck Television. For over 19 years, truck lovers across Kansas have come to Truck Stuff to transform their vehicles into the truck of their dreams. At Truck Stuff, we have over 200 different manufacturers that help us make your truck safe, keep the interior clean, provide fuel efficiency, and bring out your personality. What desires do you have for your pride and joy? Whether your vehicle is for work or for play, come see restyling experts at Truck Stuff, 427 North Washington, beautifying America one truck at a time. Dominate the field with Steve Vance Race Engines. Custom engine design and assembly including Ford, Chevy, Chrysler, and any other brand. Custom ground camshafts, one-of-a-kind induction systems and intake ports. Performance cylinder head porting and valve grinding on every head. Cylinder head machining on the state-of-the-art sturdy seat and guide machine. Computerized flow testing with performance trends data collection. Trust your power with a builder that boasts three NASCAR championship rings. Steve Vance Race Engines. Call 704-701-4235 or find them on the web at sbrehorsepower.com. Welcome, race fans, to the 2009 race season at Kansas Badland, home of the dual lane bog pit trucks exploding through a mud pit from mud hell. hell. <laughs> First race happens Saturday, May 30th, as the MAMR trucks do battle in the dual lane pits. And make plans now to be at the Badlands in August for the MRA National Point Series race. Over 250 acres of ATV trails, tracks, and fun. You'll find us just south of Wichita, 935. Kansas Badlands, where the adrenaline is always free. Mud Truck TV. Welcome to Mud Truck TV, the Pro Bat All Star Series Nationals. Chuck Cordy and the Mud Missile from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. From Pleasant Lake, Michigan, Bob Dunham and Rolling Thunder. The first uh, of round one here in Cobbtown, Georgia, with Pro Bad. The Pro Bad stars of the show. These blown alcohol dirt dragsters, folks. You are uh, not going to believe what you're about ready to see and experience. I ch- uh, you tell you what, folks, when you go to these races, you stand next to the fence, you can literally feel the ground shake and the earth come alive when these blown alcohol dirt dragsters get ready to do their thing like they're getting ready to do right now. Chuck Cordy on the near side and Bob Dunham on the far side in that rolling thunder car. Get ready, get set for race action. It's about to get wild and crazy here on Mud Truck TV. Great run there, Chuck. 42.256 and Bob Dunham. Oh, a crash. Rollover at the end. 2.267 was the time. Let's uh, check out this replay. What happened with the Rolling Thunder car? Looks as though the rear end kind of gets uh, away from him here at the very end of this uh, shutdown area. A very violent rollover right here. Wow. Emergency uh, teams responding to the uh, to the crash scene here. They've got the car flipped back over on its wheels. Paramedics checking out uh, Bob Dunham. Wow, you got to hope he's all right after a crash like that. You see Chuck Cordy uh, making his way over to uh, to Bob here. The paramedics, uh, looks like they've got a, a neck brace of some sort. Going to put that around him, make sure he's uh, safe and okay. 
I'll tell you what, uh, high speed and a rollover right there. Let's go back and look at that one more time here. Looks like both cars are pretty much nice and straight. But again, in the shutdown area, something went wrong with a Rolling Thunder car. It got upside down. You can see it right here. He starts to go sideways. With that much speed, that's all it takes. And over he goes. Wow, what a crash. We'll uh, get you news as soon as it's available on uh, his condition. Hope everything turns out all right. You see the car there getting taken away. Next pair to the track here, Sean Barber back in black from Ellsbury, Missouri.